Okay, to have a recap, just before going into the draw procedures, let us have one more look at the teams as they emerge from the group. In Group A, we had Memelodi Sundance and TP Mozambique from DRC. Group B, we have Asek Mimosa and Simba SC from Tanzania. And in Group C, we have Atletico Petroleos, which came out the first team, and Esperanza Tunis. And in Group D, we have Alali of Egypt and Young Africans. Now, the only draw constraint that we have for this evening is to, to make sure that two teams from the same uh, group in the group stage cannot be paired against each other. So we cannot have uh, Mamelodi Sundowns and TP Mozambique playing in the quarterfinals. Same thing in Group B, we cannot have Alali playing against Yanga. Atletico Petroleos cannot play against Esperanza Tunis and Asak Mimosa cannot be played against Simba. To make sure that does not happen, we have Ahmed Salem, manager of the competition. He's going to be assisting us this evening and we're going to start with the port with the teams with the runners up which is uh, the port in front of Isiaka. We have TP Mazembe in there, Simba, Esperanza Tunis and Young Africans. The first team will be revealed and then Salem will make sure that we don't have the teams in the same port. So Siaka, <coughs> please do us the honors by revealing the first team in our first quarter final. Simba SC. Simba FC, the pride of Tanzania. Simba SC will be playing the first quarter final. Simba, they will be elevating the pride of East African football. Simba FC cannot play against Aztec Mimosa. El Ali of Egypt. Formidable 11 times winners. They'll be aiming for glory again. So we have Simba, who has been held bound on promoting football in East Africa, club football playing against El Ali for quarterfinals too. Siaka. TP Mazembe. TP Mozambique from DRC. They'll be playing against either Asak Mosa or Atletico Petroleo as they cannot play against. Somebody be coming out, so please. Uh, I'm a Hassan. Atletico Beto. Atletico Petroleos, they remain undefeated. They have a defense that has not yet been <laughs> reached as they have a clean sheet in the competition. Tipping huh? Mozambique against Atletico Petroleos and the quarterfinal three we have Esperanza Tunis against Asak Mimosa and quarterfinals four we have Young Africans against Memelodi Sundowns. Je vais poser une question à Siaka. Nous avons terminé le tirage de de la quart de finale. Esperanza Tunis est une équipe qui connaît très bien cette compétition. Ils ont déjà quatre titres. Je pense que Asak Mimosa peut faire la même chose que l'équipe nationale a fait la carte. Je pense que déjà c'est l'espoir de Tunis et Asak Mimosa, c'est deux clubs qui se connaissent depuis longtemps. Très bien, qui ont l'habitude de se côtoyer. J'ai même gagné avec la SEC, la Super League, la Super League d'Afrique contre l'Espagne et Tunisien. C'est deux équipes qui se connaissent très bien. Et je pense que celui qui aura plus d'expérience à cette compétition pourra, à ce match par exemple, aura la chance de remporter ce match. Je pense aussi la même chose. Et si jamais il y a un moment pour la SEC, c'est cette année comme 
but I, I believe this year is the year for Champs and Sethani. Because they have uh, luck. Mexi, uh, Thank you very much. Hassan, I would ask you, Simba, Al Ali, they know each other very well. What do you think would be the fate of Simba, who have been amazing this year? أكيد أنا بت للنادي الأهلي إنه يقدر بطولة لأني نادي الأهلي دائما عنده ميزة إنه هو متميز في إحراز البطولة ولكن ما فيش مباراة سهلة كل المباريات هتبقى صعبة النادي الأهلي عشان يوصل لحقق البطولة لازم يتخطى سيمبا ولازم يتخطى كل فرق إنما وجهة نظري هو المباراة الأفضل بالنسبة للنادي الأهلي كل التوفيق ليك لأن QF3. 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 So the first semi final will be played between the winners of Speranza Tunis and Asak Mimosa. And the return leg will be played well. Please, Ahmed Hassan. QF4. QF4. So we played between the winners of Young Africans and Mamelodi Sundowns. And semi final two for the first leg. QF2. QF2. So it will be played either in Lumumbashi or in Angola. And last but not the least, QF1. QF1. Return leg will be played either in Tanzania or in Egypt between the winners of Simba and Al Ali. And for the finals, it will be played on a home and away leg. The first leg will be played uh, between the winners in semi final one, and the return leg will be played in the winners of the second semi final. And this completes our draw this evening for the quarter final, semi finals, and the final. Wishing all the teams all the best of luck. And the uh, quarterfinals will start in the month of March. And we would be making exceptions for the kickoff times to make accommodation for the teams that are observing the holy month of Ramadan. So, in the meantime, thank you very much, Ahmed Hassan and Siakatene. All the best to all the teams. And we're looking forward to seeing who is going to be crowned the champions for this edition. Thank you and good evening.